EA Sports and the PGA Tour are proud to present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. This afternoon from TPC Sawgrass in Ponte Vedra Beach, Florida, live third round coverage of the players. Well, if yesterday was any indication, we should be in for a memorable weekend of golf here as we take in the leaderboard on this Saturday. Our leader here on Saturday is our featured golfer. He's got a sizable advantage here as he looks to increase it further. And that a wonderful tee shot. It's in the fairway here to get this Saturday started. Now from just 94 yards out, this is second. Ah, good shot. Safely on the green and a birdie chance. This is a 13-footer. Ooh, good speed there. That'll leave just a couple of feet. Okay, that's in for par here at the first. And that's going to keep this large lead right where it is. Another good tee shot for him to start the round as he gets another fairway here at the second. Got every bit of that to it all the way there and got it to stop. Home in two on the par five. So a chance now to bring this par five to its knees. A long eagle putt. effort right there that was tracking much of the way and it'll leave a short one for birdie yeah well done it's a birdie here at the second and that's going to move him to 24 under par A very sensible play there, right in the middle of the green. We welcome in Iona Steven. This, a putt for birdie. And this putt's gonna wanna go left all day long. It's back up the slope as well. Oh, wow, that is some kind of putt. Perfect speed, perfect line. It's in for a birdie. And he's got it to 25 under par now. Good smart play right here. If you're not positive you can clear it, you, you can't take on that water. And this will leave just a short wedge in from there. So from a little more than 70 yards, this is second.
Okay, that one finished off. It's a par here at four. And he's going to maintain that substantial lead. We've already seen some narrow landing areas on these first few holes. Number five, no different, and that is really a good tee shot there. Frank now getting set for the second shot here at the fifth. A relatively big green or flat green, but you've got to be careful. If you miss it on the left, um, especially in that left rough just short of the bunker, it's a little devilish of a chip. Rich, is that eight or nine feet? <laughs> Not that bad, but it is a great approach. Shot. This a little under 10 feet for birdie. Yes, a good read. It's a birdie here at five. And with that, his score moves to 26 under par. Excellent position here, just uh, somewhere between 90 and 100 yards. Should be able to dial a wedge in nicely. This is an 11 foot putt. Nah, the putter bails him out there. That's in for a par. And he'll remain well in control of this tournament. Beautiful tempo to that swing, and this is going to wind up squarely in the fairway. From the fairway, Iona, this his second. Yes, 135 yards left to the flag. Pin in the back right portion of the screen. And safely on deck. That's the main thing, but from that distance, really don't want to leave yourself like a knee knocker, like a four or five footer. So this first putt's going to have to be good. I nearly had it. Just going to wander a foot or so by. That one finished off. It'll be a par here at seven. And he's going to stay at 26 under par.
Okay, not taking any chances there. A good, safe play in the middle portion of the green. Birdie chance here. Very long putt, though. Got to be a little careful if it gets away on him. Pretty good effort right there. Just a tap in. Mm, boy, that's a good stroke. Just a fraction off target, but you can't get the speed any better than that. Okay, that in four par here at the eighth. And he'll stay right where he is. so simple when you're going good, doesn't it? And that is yet another solid drive. That's what he wanted to do. After the tee shot, puts himself in a really good position here on the par five. Shot after shot, more evidence there with that beautiful touch. This would be a good way to finish off the front side. Easy as can be. It's a tap-in birdie here at the ninth. And he's going to go out in 32, four under par. Turning out to be a wonderful Saturday of golf here, and this, another fine tee shot. So, Iona, this is second from the fairway. 127 yards to get you to the front of this green, but it's 138 yards you'll need to get all the way to the hole. Wind coming from behind, so you'll need to be careful where you land it. That's a good shot, and more importantly, too, a green in regulation, so birdie chance. Okay, well done. A couple of birdies here sandwiched around the turn at 9 and 10. He moves to 28 under par. No issues here. That is into the fairway. That was unlucky, too. If that ball had just slowed down, it could have been an eagle putt. Just kept going. Oh, just over the back. Okay, a good out, and that's what will remain for birdie. 
Oh, how about the run here? That a third consecutive birdie. And he'll get that score to minus 29. Turning out to be a wonderful Saturday of golf here, and this, another fine tee shot. Breeze at his back shoulder as he lines up his second from the fairway. play from that distance. Just use the putter to make sure you get the line and this one goes down for a birdie. That one going to wind up smack dab in the middle of the green. Now this for another birdie. And this is back up the slope. Fortunately, not a great deal of movement to it, but there is a little bit of right to left. Yep, not bad. Had to put a little extra into that one, but got it there. That's a pretty good effort. Well judged, that is in for par here at 13. And he'll remain 30 under par. Once again, another great tee shot. Uh, I'm starting to wonder how low can you go? and the driving has been simply superb. He'll be factoring in this breeze in his face as he sets for a second. Had a birdie here yesterday in their close. Great opportunity for another one. That's how you play this 14 pole. That's in for birdie. And that score continues to impress. He is now at 31 under par. Turning out to be a wonderful Saturday of golf here, and this, another fine tee shot. From an ideal location, middle of the fairway, this his second. Certainly had enough power, just didn't have any touch. Okay, a solid par here at the 15th. And he'll remain well, well under par. A 
just what you want at this point in the round. You're trying to find a rhythm, hit fairways, hit the middle of the club face. That's what they did right there. Shot right there, landed just short, released onto the green, and now a chance for an eagle three. Two great shots have led to this. It's for eagle. Oh, yeah. I mean, some days you just can't miss, and this is one of those days. What a putt there, as he'll walk away with an eagle. Side of three feet. That is very well done. Nicely done. Birdie finished off here at 17. And that's going to get him to minus 34. Turning out to be a wonderful Saturday of golf here, and this, another fine tee shot. Frank, it's all about focus and positive imagery, isn't it, here on this approach shot at the 18th? You have to be precise with your target here. You can't be looking left at the water or mounds on the right. Plus, there's all the mounding on the screen. So, in the end, look at the flag, aim at the flag, go there. Ooh, that was going to be a good shot when it left the club face. What's that? Eight or nine feet? Excellent shot. Chance now for another birdie. Yeah, it's a birdie at the last. And that won't quite get them into the 50s, but well, that's quibbling. This is a round of 60. Huge spot right here after 54 holes at the players. Our featured golfer on top of the star-studded leaderboard. They'll take the pole position going into Sunday's final round. And this is the tournament. That these are your peers that you're trying to beat. This is the strongest tournament on the PGA Tour that's run by the PGA Tour. So it's a chance just to stamp and put your name in a place where very few have been. So that'll do it for my partner here in the tower, Frank Nabilo. For Nota Begay, Iona Steven, and all our crew, Rich Lerner saying, we'll see you next time on EA Sports PGA Tour.